What's up guys? If I was dead, is this what heaven would look like? It's kind of nice. I mean, it's quiet. There's nothing in here, just a big empty white room. Interesting. I know that the last video I made, I kind of left some things hanging and I didn't really mean to, so for anybody that's wondering, I did pass all three of my Microsoft exams, I did get my certification, and um, yeah, so I'm back home. I mean, here in heaven. Today I want to talk to you about something just kind of, just, you know, just crazy. Sometimes I, I tell personal information, like the fact that I don't own a gun, right? Well, apparently some people out there don't like the fact that I don't like guns. They don't care about my opinions, and not only that, they really want to bash me and try to threaten me and even scare me on the internet. One such person is a user by the name of Caleb Santos, who kind of sort of threatened me with some stuff and told me that I should buy a gun and go kill myself with it and some other things like that and just a lot of stuff that I just really didn't appreciate. A long story short, Caleb ended up bothering me to the point that I ended up just blocking him. I was like, go back to your own channel, Caleb. Joe, somebody don't want you here. Joe, somebody don't want you here. I don't want you here. Because sometimes I refer to myself in the third person. Well, I guess the fact that Caleb got blocked from my YouTube channel infuriated him to the point that he came to my Facebook fan page and started pestering me there. On the fan page, he sent me direct messages and was still talking way down, condescending to me and telling me to just get out of America, move to Sweden, nobody wants me here, and all kinds of just absurd things. So, I didn't care for that, so I decided I was going to block him there. Joe, somebody don't want you here. While I was in the process of blocking Caleb on Facebook, I moused over his username, which showed me a little generic banner of his profile and said that he was a state trooper for the uh, Massachusetts State Police. Huh? I was like, what? You mean to tell me that you a cop and you following me around on the internet trying to make me feel like scared for my life and crap and telling me I should kill myself? That ain't right. Feeling threatened and confused why a Massachusetts State Police Officer would harass me on YouTube, follow me to Facebook and harass me there, I decided it might be a good idea if I contacted the Massachusetts State Police and let them know what Caleb was up to. Well, there's only one problem with that. The Massachusetts State Police have never heard of Caleb Santos. That's right, apparently this guy's some sort of nut job and just put on his Facebook profile that he works for the Massachusetts State Police, when in fact he does not. If there's anything I want you to get from this video today, it's that you should be extremely careful on the internet. People will use the internet to turn themselves into anything that they've ever wanted to be. They'll impersonate a cop, men will impersonate women, I could even tell you I'm Joe somebody. Of course, I am Joe somebody. But, I don't... What? Which isn't really anything. I don't know if that's a good point. Be careful on the internet. Don't harass and bully people via the comment section of YouTube or harass them on their Facebook fan page. That doesn't help anybody and you can actually get in a lot of trouble for doing that. Not only will harassing people not ever get you anywhere and could get you in a heap of trouble with the police, but you just need to learn to let go and love yourself. Dr. Phil says love yourselves. Anyway, that's all I wanted to share with you today, guys. I'm Joe Somebody, this is Heaven, and I'll see you next time.